Hey guys, Mario 3 back here with more Spyro, and today we are going to Peacekeeper's World. Where they keep peace, I guess. So this is pretty much a dev uh, devil, desert-based world. Somewhat. And yeah. Let's see, what do we got cl to collect here? Three dragons, 200 gems, and I think that said one egg. And Titan. Welcome to Peacekeeper, Spyro. Look how our treasure has been turned against us and stolen. We cover our treasure, Spyro. Collect treasure. Got it. Gotta collect them all. Okay, so these guys will be everywhere and they moon you and stuff. And you have to use their cannons that they're shooting, too. You can fly them from behind. Okay, here's the first world we're gonna be going to. Dry Canyon. It's probably gonna be the first world, but right now we gotta kill some people. And if they go in here and you burn it down, they'll moon you, which is exactly what I want to see right about now. Somebody mooning me. There's the next tent guy. Yeah, you better moon me. I'm a bunch of losers. Um, Cliff Town. will probably be the second level we do. But now... I might do... No, I'm not doing the flight first. I'll save that for last. Magnus. Hi, Spyro. Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing a good job protecting you. Make sure to keep him strong by feeding him lots of butterflies. Yes, mommy. Okay, down here is Ice Cavern. They do that a lot, I think, in games. In Desert Worlds, they just have like a... Like a world that's like cool or... Like nothing to do with the desert. Like I know in Hot Lands and... Uh, Kirby's Epic Yarn. They have, like, cool cave. They just have stuff that contradicts itself. Get away. Okay. So here we gotta destroy these chests. Supposed to destroy this one with this too. Oh yeah, we also gotta destroy that little barrier too. Oh, come on. I like Spyro 2 and 3 better because the controls I think are better. And I think they're just more fun. So I can't wait to get to those. Because those are gonna be really fun, I think. For me, at least, because I've played those games a lot in my childhood. Mm, um, I've never beaten this game 100%. And there's the boss, you're ready. And the flight level's up there, but I'm gonna save that for last. Just one random guy up here. Uh, should I just do it now? Yeah, why not? Uh, I mean, I'm right here, might as well. Nothing behind it. Let's just go do it now, and I'll finish Peacekeepers in a bit. I just really don't like these flight levels. Okay. I'm almost caught up to my practice file, too. The flight levels, like I said, I think, and I know Spyro 3 has them. They're much better than those games, but... I failed this one a lot, I remember, especially on the light, lighting up the lighthouses. I know I screwed that one up a lot. That's really the only hard thing to do in this one, is lighting up the lighthouses. But I think I've... Whoa, don't go in there, the water. I think I've practiced enough. Or I failed enough that I learned from my mistakes. I 
think I got it, yeah. Okay, that's good. But I'm almost, um, caught back up to my practice file. Because I'm in the third world in my practice file, and I haven't beaten it yet. So i got to start playing that again. So this is a really short game. I mean, the first world only had two parts. This one will probably have, like, three or something. But it'll still be short. Okay, here's a third dragon, and here's the thief. I would have had him too. It wasn't for you and your stupid kids. And there's a key. Um, I don't know where the chest is, but it's just Gunner. 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 Well done, Spyro. Keep up the good work, and I know you'll fulfill your destiny. Destiny? I just want to kick some. Just toast those enemies and collect the treasure. Yeah, you tell. Them. Okay, thief, it's you and me. Oh, come on, how'd that not hit him? What was that? <laughs> Get a little confused there, thief. Ego. Did I blow up that chest or what? I might have. I'm already back at the start, so. I don't know. Oh. It's in there. Can I go all the way around? See, the bad thing about leaving is now these guys respawn. Come on, bunny. Die! Stupid bunnies. Chicks are for kids. <laughs> I want to finish Peacekeepers now. Okay, so I guess we gotta climb this. And fly over, and it's probably down here. Yep. And it's gonna have ten jewels in it. And we have finished Peacekeepers! Right? Come on, get 200. Yeah. Finish Peacekeeper's main world, and now let's go to the levels. Let's just heal up here. And let's go to Dry Canyon, I think it was. Yep, Dry Canyon. already. Got him. Oh, I should check what spoils are in this. Okay, I got the egg. Four dragons, 400 gems. Yeah, the gems are now starting to kick up. They're starting to get a lot more gems. These controls are weird. Yeah, because I haven't played Spyro in like forever. Like the whole series. And dragon number one. Conan. <laughs> Thank you for releasing me. You're welcome. Hey. To die. Okay. I remember I spent a lot of time wandering around on this map trying to find the key. Yeah, I think it was just me trying to find the key. Let's just go in here. Whoops. Yeah, you carry that bird. Ow. Either. I'm 
just going in this area. It is because... I think the chest is in this area, so... Yeah. Second dragon, Ivor. <laughs> That you, Spyro? Are you the young dragon I've been hearing so much about? Ever since you're a wee puff of smoke, we've known... Uh... You've known? Ah, I forget. <laughs> okay. I don't know how you'd hear the rumors when you were kind of a statue. Yeah, come after me, bird. I think this actually leads to the end of the level in a bit, once we go up there. But first, I'm gonna go here. And I probably should have just flamed it. Okay, another life, which gives me an 8, which I really don't care about. Um, I wanna that's where the chest is, so I'm gonna wait to go there. Until I actually get the key. I gotta remember where the key is first, though. First, let's play some fireworks. Okay, almost halfway in jewels. And now we are exactly halfway in jewels. And up here is the end of the level, I think. Yeah, we just took a alternate path. You can get that, you know. Okay, I'll get it. Ooh, 25. I like those. And here's the end. I think I remember where the key is. Though, so I think it's like on a really hidden ledge. Yeah, right there. Yep, up there. Um, can't get it to it from here, if I remember correctly. <laughs> no, you can't. Um. Yeah, there's a there's a ledge that you have to get to it from. I remember that. So yeah, I think I, I don't think I'll remember the ledge when I see it. Yeah, don't even do anything, yeah, bird. Bird brain. Do you already have three dragons? I only have two. There's one near that key, so we'll probably run into one here. Yeah, right up there. Yeah, somewhere up here is where, right there, I think. Yeah, you climb back up there. Dry Canyon rewards good gliders. You are a good glider, eh, Spyro? I was born to glide. <laughs> yeah, see, rewards good gliders. So that's kind of a hint. So, why is this platform up here? You might wonder. Well, let's go all the way down here. Go through here. right up here, and then you're like, well, this is a dead end if I ever saw one, but if you fly around this corner, see? Rewards good gliders. And you get the key and the dragon. We get Maximus. 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 Incredible glide, Spyro. I thought I'd be stuck here forever with those ugly vultures standing on my head. Those birds might look tough. They're pretty tasty. Plain broiled, with a pinch of salt. Okay. Good to know. Let's get that key. And make our way back. Can I jump up that? Nope, gotta go around. <laughs> and so we're pretty much done with the level now. It's just that one part that... 
can be kind of tricky to find. Was well, tricky to find my first time, but you know, we only spent about seven, eight minutes on this level, which is good, I guess. So let's run our way back, <laughs> so we can fly to the island. Make it from here. Should I, no, I should fly from there, shouldn't I? Okay, let's finish this level. And please tell me I got everyone. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Yeah! Okay, let's leave, and I think next is Cliff Town, which I think I also had a few problems finding those last couple gems. That's why I'm doing a practice run this game, because I've never beaten it 100%. Tomorrow 2 and 3 I won't do a practice run, because I think those games are easy enough, so... They're easy enough to do everything, and I've 100% of them before, so... Yeah. Okay, next should be Cliff Town, which is right here. Get in there. Entering Cliff Town. Population none. I like the starting spot here. It doesn't make you th think that you're in a desert, but you actually are. Yeah, over here, you have to fly up there and get some tools back there, and that's what I didn't do last time. Some nice weird music. <laughs> yeah, and you gotta hit all the pots. Because the pots have jewels in them, too. Okay, what do we got? We got a thief and three dragons. Oh, why not hurt you? What? Die. I'm at full health too. <laughs> got slapped twice. Halver. How's a dragon supposed to flame metal armor anyway? Remember, Spyro, flame won't harm metal, but charging with your horns, that should do the trick. Yeah, and you're teaching me this in the second world, why? You know, I think I should have known that in the first world. 